Hey friends, this is Laura from The Whole Physician coming to you on another Warm Fuzzy Wednesday during our Spirituality Week as we talk about trials or spiritual lessons or the things that drive us nuts or annoy us or frustrate us or whatever it is that we come across in our life that isn't going exactly how we planned it to go. The reality is, and we've talked about this before, that normal life will have about 50% positive and 50% negative emotion associated with it. So you might think about this in terms of if you don't get what you want, you get the lesson that you need. And that's really true. The things that we experience that are unpleasant to us oftentimes are here to provide a lesson for us. And I'm sure many of us can look back through our lives and see those moments of frustration or annoyance or even anger and realize that we were being taught lessons during that time. I would love to hear some of the stories that you have of times when things were difficult or frustrating that actually turned into lessons for you. I'll share one with you. I remember being in residency as um, I think I was probably a third year emergency medicine resident and I was taking care of a patient who was in for a COPD exacerbation. And I was so frustrated because he was still smoking and here he was back in the department, um, really short of breath and, and it was super frustrating. And I said to him, I said, you know why you're here, don't you? And do you know what he said to me? He said, don't judge me. You have no right to judge me. And that really put me in my place. I was, you know, it was clear that he had some behavioral issues that were making his, his medical issues worse. And I was just trying to help him see that and help him do the right thing. But the way I presented it to him was really not very respectful and was kind of rude. And so I still remember him. It's been more than 20 years probably. But I still remember that patient and the lesson he taught me that day when I learned that regardless of my patient's behavior, I need to treat them with respect and love. And so anyway, that's, that's just one example of the many that were difficult circumstances or annoying situations that turned into lessons for me. And we would love to hear some of yours that have helped you become a better person. And we hope that you guys have a great rest of your week, sending you lots of hugs and warm wishes for your warm, fuzzy Wednesday. And we will talk to you soon. Bye.